Minecraft. Exactly. After like, like maybe 900 videos on my channel made only on Minecraft. Today we're gonna do something different. But this is gonna be actually amazing because I have an actually amazing and exciting announcement for you guys. And it is gonna be coming out soon. You can already play this game. This is officially the first game created by me. Yes, exactly. This is the first game I have ever created. And today I'm gonna review it, we're gonna check it out. This is something I've never done on the channel, so I don't know what's happening. Uh, but anyways, I'm gonna tell you the premise of this game, what it's gonna be about. And also I'm gonna talk about a challenge. And here comes the Minecraft bit, because if you win this challenge, you're gonna get a prize of your choosing in Minecraft. So basically you're gonna get an iPixel rank, so a vi VIP or VIP plus rank, I don't care, whatever you need, whatever you require, and you know, I'm gonna show you later in the video how to win and participate in this challenge, it's not really really hard, and not many people are gonna be participating probably, so you have a really big chance to win this, so follow this video through to, you know, have a chance to participate. For all of you that just watch my channel and are not on my Discord and stuff like that, you may say, Nico, what is this game? What even are you talking about? You make games? Yeah, I started getting into game develop uh, de development. I started getting in game development, like, in a, f a few months ago. Two, one or two months ago, actually. And this is the idea for a game I came up with. And, you know, I'm really excited to show you this. It's basically a Sokoban style puzzle game. So, you know, it's gonna be puzzly, okay? So far, it's not an unfair game, okay? We might, uh, we may add, like, something, like, to make it a little bit more unfair. But so far, it looks like a pretty fair game. So, as you can see, you are this charter, like, right here. And you have to try to reach the exit by collecting keys and try to move blue blocks and stuff like that. This is the tutorial le level, just to show you all of the features this game has. I'm gonna play the tutorial level and then we're gonna go crack on to the editor, because as you can see, there is not only the game, but there is also an editor where you can create your own games. And this is where the tournament part is gonna come in, okay? By the way, if you wanna know how I created this game, with what, uh, you know, engine, and, you know, how it works, I'm gonna leave a link in the description to my second channel, I'm gonna upload a full description video on how to create games and how I reached to create this little test so you can experiment. By the way, this is just a, a, a very good editor, look at that, you can even zoom, you can even uh, click on blocks, you can select the block you wanna place. We're gonna go through every single block today in this video, it's gonna be amazing. You can also save some of your creations, like you can call it high and save it, and then, you know, even if you clear it, like if you do this, and you go away, and you come back, if you load it and call it high, and load high, as you can see, it's gonna load it back, so this is pretty cool, but anyways, let's go in the tutorial level, so as you can see, we're gonna correct, collect the key, we're gonna throw the tiggy tig, the block into the void, so we can pass through, because as you can see, in here, we cannot pass through, and by the way, this game is available for download, you can download it already, it's gonna be in the description, but finish the video before downloading, because this is gonna get really exciting. So you may see that there are some numbers, like on these uh, tiles, so basically it says 1, 1 means that you can only go through it once, so as you can see, if I go through it once, no, nothing happens. Well, that's embarrassing, well, the version I'm playing with is a little bit bugged, but I fixed all of the bugs in the, newer, uh, in the newest version, but that one is still not... Uh, uh, you know, uh, uploaded and published, so you're gonna have to play with this buggy version. But as you can see, if you reload the game, it's gonna work, so as you can see, if you do this, it's gonna go to 1, so you can only go those blocks uh, a certain number of times. And then right here we can collect the red key, and then we can do this, boom, and we can go all the way back. So now we have a red key. Where should we put the red key? Hmm, I don't know. Maybe right here on this red lock. And now there is our third feature. We have these blocks that can only be, uh, you know, you can only go on those blocks in a certain direction. As you can see, I cannot go back, or I can go to the left. So I'm forced to do, to take this path, get the yellow key back again, go all the way to the right, unlock this stuff right here, and now we have like a ton of keys. Look at that. This inventory is gonna show you, uh, show us all of the keys that we have. And now we're gonna use them all right here. By the way, this game uh, contains a lot of textures and sounds, uh, effect. Uh, those were all made by me. I tried to, you know, not steal anything from this game. I wanted to create a game that, you know, was 100% my content. Because, you know, I wanna try and see if I can create a zero-budget game. It's gonna be pretty hard, because, you know, seriously, 
Uh, it took me a really long time to make this, and I'm really new to development. You may say, Nico, you're so expert. That, that's not true, like, I, I don't know what I'm doing, seriously. This is the first time I'm ever developing a game. Anyways, uh, talking about other stuff, we reached this new block right here. This is basically a teleporter. It's gonna teleport us in, into a different location. And this is the checkpoint block. In the version of the game that we are currently playing, it's a little bit bugged. Uh, but in the new version it's gonna be fixed, so don't worry about it. I already fixed it, I just gotta uh, publish the version. But as you can see, if we fail, uh, the checkpoint is gonna help us right here. So we can do this, and then we should go down here, yes, and then we can do this. By the way, spoilers if you didn't check the map yet, uh, and then play, play the level. Anyways, there is this red block that is gonna kill us, so we're not gonna go there. And this is the end. Once we reach the end, we are back to the editor. So now you basically know what each and every block does. Now we can get straight into the editor. And here is the fun part where you guys come in. And I'm gonna actually show some levels you guys have already created that were like literally amazing. Cannot wait to show you those. So as you can see, now we have this editor and from here, as I showed before, you can select some blocks and you can do basically whatever you want. And then you can save and load your level on your computer. But what if you wanna export the level and give it to a, a friend of yours. Well, that's extremely simple. All you have to do is click on this share button, okay? And then click on the share button. You're gonna have a level code uh, copied into your clipboard. What that means is that you can open Discord, an example. So we're gonna open Discord right now, and we're gonna go into our Discord server, the coding Discord server, that you can join, the link is in the description. And we go in locked tournament, then we can paste our code here. So as you can see, if we do Ctrl V, we're gonna have the code pasted. So there are like a lot of levels already for the competition, and this is what the tournament is about. You're gonna be able to easily create your own level, and who creates the best level ever, uh, you know, out of everyone, is gonna win an iPixel rank. So this is the competition, it's gonna be amazing. All you have to do is download the game, it's in the description. You're gonna also have to join the Discord, that is also in the description. There is gonna be a lot more info in the description. And then in locked tournament you have to put the level code. Now I played every single levels of these people and they were really amazing. Uh, but I wanna show uh, one of them so we're gonna just randomly take one of them. We're gonna go back in our game and where is it? Okay let's go on the uh, share and you can do boom and then you have to click on open and as you can see we open the level. Oh I remember this level. This level was actually pretty fun. So you have to go in every single teleporter, get a key. Yeah I remember this. So we're getting every single key, uh, the green one, and oh, the blue one, oh yeah, I remember the blue one was the hardest, because look at this, there is this little troll right here. If you go down here, you're just stuck, so you're, you have to go up here, because you know, you have this map creator, I feel like these people are, like, because I do have fear maps, they're gonna be able to troll me so much, because they're like gonna take revenge for what I've done. So now we got the blue key too, so now we may be able, yeah, we can go back, yeah, that's right. Okay, so now we have to go back into the teleporter. And then we probably go this way, and we finish the level. So yeah, this was one of the levels, we're gonna play another one actually. Oh by the way, this guy right here made the impossible level, like, he seriously said if you complete this, you have 2000 IQ. I tried to play this for half an hour, and I got close to finishing it, but then I didn't finish it ever. And I don't wanna do it right now, maybe we're gonna do it in a live stream. But if you guys wanna go, uh, wanna have a go at it, uh, you can download it. It says that it's for the Alpha uh, 0.1 version, but it's gonna work in the newest version too, so don't worry about it. This one is dead, it's not gonna work in the new version, uh, because um, it, it, it included some glitches. He was a naughty boy, he, he included glitches in his levels. So no, we're not gonna play this one, because you put glitches in my level, how, how dare you. Anyway, just to finish off, let's play with this one, uh, uh, let, let's see what this one is about. Feel like I already played it, but still. Oh yeah, oh my gosh, this was, uh, was impossible. Okay, let's see if I can remember it correctly. This one was pretty hard. Can I go down? Oh, I think I went the wrong way. Give me a sec, okay. I feel like I have to do this, then I have to go, yeah, I remember this one was pretty hard, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I reached so much on this level. But I wish to complete it at last, uh, even if it was pretty, <laughs> pretty considerably hard. I'm gonna show you just the first bit, maybe. <laughs> okay, so we have to do this, we have to do this, and boom, 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 and then we're up here. Then we have to do this, I guess. Yes, then we have to go up, oh my gosh, I was about to mess it up. Uh, up, okay, we can go up here. Oh yeah, that, now this was pretty hard because you don't know what you're doing. And you have to go like blindfolded, like, like right here. You have to do something like this. And now we have to to get to the end. We need to, uh, you know, get a blue key and get into a blue teleporter. So we have to remember that. And now here it's just like 
so randomness that you don't know what you're doing. And now you, you feel like you're doing something wrong. But basically what you have to do is to boom this, then boom this. Then you have to go back into the teleporter, do this kind of thing right here. <coughs> Sorry. And then you can finally push this block. You go down here, go all the way down, get into the blue thing, get the blue key, and boom, we finish the level. First try. Guys, you have to leave a like for that, okay? I finished a level in my own game. I must be amazing. Okay, apart from the jokes, let's play one last level. Uh, uh, let, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. We're gonna play this one. Boom. This is the last level I'm gonna play, and there is nothing. Did it, did, wait, what? Oh, oops, I coded the code. I mean, I put the code wrong, I'm sorry. So, as you can see, now, if we do this, this was kind of a weird level. Look at this. So, you have to kind of... Uh, oh, my gosh, this is so confusing. Okay, we go here. Oh, yeah, I remember this one. Because, look at this. You get a key, and you have to go back up, and you have to do something like this. But then when you do this, you get back, like, you go back here. You don't know what you're doing. You may say, Nico, where is the exit? And you cannot find the exit, like, there is no way. But then, if you uh, misclick and hold down, the exit is right here. Look at, look at this level. The exit was right underneath, but it was hidden. So you would think that you have to go up, but what you actually have to do is go down. And uh, I, I, I must admit, I actually misclicked and got to the end first try, and I got very confused. Uh, but you know, I can see how this level uh, would take a long, a long time for maybe someone that doesn't know that the end is here, <laughs> and it may be confusing. Anyways, I, uh, before ending this video, that has been already pretty long, I'm gonna show you some new features that I'm gonna be adding in the next version of the game that is still not out. So here we go, if we go into our uh, project, uh, yeah, right here, uh, locked, uh, locked game, Linux, and uh, yeah, test run. This is the newest version of the game, this is still in the, you know, in development, it's not finished, so as you can see, I've added some more stuff. I, I, I've added some levels of my own, so now you're gonna be able to play my own levels, uh, not only the ones created by other people, so it's gonna be like a story mode and stuff like that. And you're also gonna be able to save your progress, this means that even if you go away, the levels you completed are gonna be saved, and you can keep on, you know, playing. And also, there's gonna be more stuff added to the editor. As you can see, we have this button right here uh, that is gonna let us do some crazy stuff. So if we get a lot of blocks, okay, and maybe we want to move them, we can use the rectangle selection and do this. And so as you can see, these ones are selected, and now we can move them around. So as you can see, this, this is kind of this kind of cool, okay. And this is uh, the new stuff that I'm gonna be adding. I've also fixed a lot of bugs, like the bug uh, that, you know, appeared before. This is the, you know, just to play the tutorial level. As you can see now, the bug doesn't happen anymore. This always turns to void. And by the way, the bugs have been reported by you wonderful people. So, you know, uh, shout outs to Gkid for, uh, you know, literally reporting more than uh, 10 bugs every time I uploaded a new version of the game. So, you, you are truly amazing. Also, a little bit nerve wracking, but uh, mostly truly amazing. And yeah, this is all I wanted to show you. So, if you want to participate in the tournament and have a chance to win an iPixel rank or iPixel, of course, then you just have to download the game, it's gonna be a page, and you have to download the zip file, then you can uncompress it and, you know, play it for whatever uh, operating system you want. Also, there is gonna be a Discord, and I already showed you that. So, that's it, I hope you really enjoyed. I really sincerely hope I can do more with this game and, you know, try to uh, upload it somewhere else. Maybe w once it's actually ready, it has no bugs, I can try to upload it on Steam. That would be actually something to look forward to. Would you guys enjoy that? I may also do a mobile version of this game, so you can play it on your phone too. But for now, this is all I have to give you guys. I hope you really enjoyed this new style of video. If you want to see more of this, just let me know and leave a like, so you know I can uh, have a feedback on uh, what did you think of this video. Hope you really enjoyed this video, really amazing to make, and I'm gonna see you guys in the next one.